the world's greatest hitting formula didn't pop up overnight. It's been a combination of 41 years of experiences and research, uh, laboratory testing, field testing, from a player's perspective, from a coach's perspective, and from a perspective of someone that's working in the scouting department. All these experiences combined have built up, and, and prayer, have built the world's greatest hitting formula. Years ago, when we started the languagehitting.com and uh, I became a coach decades ago, I knew that inside the realms of teaching hitting, whether it be from a baseball perspective or softball perspective, that what really rests inside the best hitters is timing. My only problem was, how do I explain it? How do I converse it? How do I communicate it back to the player that we're trying to build and help? I've come to realize that before, as a community, we try to fix the ball player and the hitter, we really need to fix the coach. Too many times the coaches, they're, they're put into the same uh, position as a golf instructor. We look at hitting a baseball or softball in the same perspective as a golf coach. A golf instructor will draw a box around a golfer, analyze every nook and cranny from toe to knee to hip to, to um, swing path to elbow, everything. And, and baseball and softball coaches have copied that same pattern and formula when we look at our hitters on, on a field. We put them in a box and we analyze just this area right here. Well, the composition for baseball versus golf, it's a lot different. Golf, we have a stationary object that's not moving. If baseball had a stationary object, well, maybe we can compare the two the same. But the composition in baseball and softball, it has this. You have a moving hitter, you have a moving pitcher, and obviously you got a moving ball. The big problem is how to get all in sync together. That's where the glue is, and that's where we need to train our, our coaches to be more sensitive, how do all three bodies interact together? The world's greatest hitting formula is a four hour instructions. It's four hours of instructions devoted to timing. This is unprecedented. It's gonna be hard pressed for someone to talk about timing for about a half an hour, let alone four hours. There is so many details that go involved with timing, and, and I want to teach you this, but it, it, we, we need to take small bites at a time and process it. The whole formula for the greatest formula for hitting um, is a formula that it is applicable, and we want to be able to communicate it back to the hitter so they can make and incorporate, incorporate actions in the game. That's our total goal. And um, how we communicate this is totally um, effective and it is unprecedented and it is major important just how we communicate it back to our players. This is what I've reasoned out, that sometimes people say, well, Dave, listen, hey, it's about the hips and about to get the shoulders and everything else involved. And I'm not dismissing mechanics or what I call movements because we're training athletes and we're not fixing cars. But we'll just say mechanics now, that mechanics and movements are important, but it happens at the very end of, the, of, of our actions of hitting the ball. What I've come to reason over the years and having taught over a decade of teaching mechanics and movement, how to get your elbow in the slot and keep your shoulders closed and use your, I've done all that. What I've learned the hard way was that the players who just would hit good in the games, as I really sat back and analyzed it, they were the ones who figured out timing. They were the ones who bump, who happened to bump into timing. And I knew this all along. My problem was I didn't know how to verbalize it. When I stopped teaching mechanics and put the heartbeat of, of teaching and instructing back to what I knew was the, the real issue, the real, I mean, meat potatoes was timing, players started to take off. So now, 
we have packaged everything that, I, that I've accumulated in 41 years, um, the experiences, the knowledge, the research, the field studies, it's all packaged inside of the world's greatest hitting formula. We go into great detail of the specific hitting models. Each one of those models will specifically now tell you where you turn on the adrenaline in the moment for that hitter. Everyone has a certain athletic DNA. And when you watch a hitter and you watch how his flow, flow of motion moves and you plug it into to the, the model he's trying to use, I explain to you in detail how the adrenaline matches that model and you start building together how to, how to help that hitter become first of all in sync with his own body how do, do I get my hands in sync with my feet how do I get my arms in sync with my legs next how do I get in sync with the pitcher and next how do I expect how do I learn how to plan for a ball to be ejecting out from the pitcher's body that is a generalization of what the world's greatest hitting formula will teach you but in greater detail the reason why there may seem like a higher price tag on this world's greatest hitting formula, that's because it's valuable. It's more valuable than going to your college baseball clinic and camp to meet players who are still learning how to teach. It's more valuable than working with someone who has a World Series ring, who played by feel, and they don't even know what they did but they're trying to explain to you and it just sort of falls on the wayside. This is more valuable than trying to buy your own pitching machine um, and trying to, to teach yourself. I shave all that away and I give you the, 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 the nuts and bolts, the bones, the meat and potatoes to what's really inside of hitting. For the players who are serious, for the players who have high, high ambition to play in college or play pro baseball, and, and, and give it all they got, this hitting formula is for you. You're going to love this. You need this. Stop guessing at what you're doing, okay? Put your fingers on it, and this formula will help you. A lot of things that, that, that you already do, that, that a lot of things that are in the world's greatest hitting formula, you already do. But you don't know you do them, and you end up guessing, and you end up wondering why I'm in a slump. But this this world's greatest hitting formula gives you the details, it gives you the patterns to repeat, and it works amazing. It is the best. I want to mention also that comments that Jose Batista made when you study and analyze hitters and go into research and just listen to their interviews, Jose Batista says time and in and time again that I'm a better hitter because I've improved my timing. And since I've improved my timing, I can pick up the ball better, meaning I can see the ball earlier in the flight path. And that is one of the biggest keys for this hitting formula. And we show you, not just say it, we show you physically how to see the ball earlier in the flight path. And it does, has, nothing, has nothing to do with watching the, the, the eye charts and watching dots you know, pop in and pop out. There's things that the good hitters naturally, naturally do instinctually, and we will teach you those things inside the world's greatest hitting formula. It will change your life. And I'm committed to helping you as a coach, helping you as a player. So when you get the video series, um, I'm making an offer that for a lifetime, as much as you want to send in your video clips and have me review them, I'll send you back information, okay? And we can now have a better dialogue because having watched the, the video series, okay, and, and watching your clips, now we can merge together this world's greatest hitting formula and work out all the bugs you got. We can get down to the nitty gritty and make it work. It's my prayer, it's my desire to help you as a person, and we can make a relationship together over the years, helping your player or players, and uh, in the long run, you're going to be a lot happier. And you're going to feel better as a coach because you know you've impacted some lives and you made them better on the ball field.
and they gain some, some confidence and some, some success, and they can see to look at things not just rigidly and, and vertically from a, a linear perspective, we're learning how to look at things laterally from perspectives that we haven't had before, but it's the truth. Now, I'm Dave Kirloff, Language You're Hitting, Lord bless you.